Hello community! Today, a hardware preview. Yes, we are talking about hardware AI accelerator that are will be coming. So what do you think about 192 gigabyte of memory for your GPU? Yes, finally, finally for our old fashioned Nvidia Hopper 100 configuration for our part, there will be competition. And you know, you thought, hey, the DGX100 is here at the top of the line. Not anymore. Yesterday, AMD presented something very interesting. So what they did, they simply took more or less an ME300A chip, if you want, and they presented an ME300X. And you might say, hey, what's happening in here? Well, easy. Now, the 300A was a APU accelerator for artificial intelligence and high performance computing. You had 24 CPU cores, you had 128 gigabytes of memory. And the question was hey, if we really want here to go full power with GPU, what do you think we throw out the CPU and make a pure GPU based chip? only gpu power so what we do we make it simpler we make it easier actually and we call it a 300x so this will be the new generative ai accelerator chip and it has more memory than nvidia hopper and you know hopper should be replaced about uh, end of 2024 so this will be a chip that will be really interesting and about will have a market time of one year ahead of nvidia we have no idea about the benchmarks we have no idea what it will cost it ha just has been introduced yesterday by amd but you know what's nice we have now according to anantech a 12 chiplet design so we have pure gpu power eight GPU chiplets and just another four IO memory chiplets. So this is purely focused on data center AI accelerator. And you think, okay, so can we scale it up? Yes, of course. So similar to Nvidia with its eight time Harper, we have now here the announcement of an eight times 300 X. And if you look at the memory and you think about what, NVIDIA had just 640. Now we have 1.5 terabyte memory on here, the Instinct platform. There's even something more interesting for me. Because they showed that you can run a Falcon 40 billion parameter model in memory. In memory on a single 300x GPU chiplet chip whatever you want to call it 192 gigabyte of memory this is interesting suddenly amd is discovery here the ai accelerator market currently a um, easy i don't know 30 40 billion dollar market but it is expected that this market will skyrocket to 150 billion us dollar in just some years so amd is positioning itself with some new, very interesting GPU chips. And you know what? I am glad that there's finally competition to NVIDIA data center GPUs. Even more interesting is that if it is right, what we will see, we will have a single 300X chip. No, not an eight time configuration where you have to shell out minimum, I don't know, 200,000 US dollars plus for an NVIDIA uh, configuration, but you can get single chip solutions where you can run a Falcon 40B model in memory in one chip. And even if you have here a data center solution, you know what? With competition, it will become simpler and cheaper for us to rent here our cloud's GPUs. So competition is good single chips is good whatever becomes cheaper cloud or local or whatever is your financial background this is a 
positive development that will play out, I think, in the next half year, I don't know, three quarter of a year. So finally, the hardware market for AI Accelerator is moving and we will see in the future what will happen. Uh, yeah, and a last, please, a last remark from my side. Do not compare this chip to an Apple M2 Ultra. I hope you know why. See you in my next video.